Hey there and good morning! Or as they say in Japan, Ohio gozaimasu! Are you hungry? Oh my gosh, I'm starving! We are going to make a super duper bowl of cereal! This is what I have probably like three times a week, I'd say. So let's get started. It's super healthy, but it tastes delicious. It's like a magic trick. You would never think it tastes so good, but it does. So I like to mix my cereals. We're gonna use three different ones today. What I try and do is I look for low sugar, high fiber, and high protein. You want the sugar to try and be like 10 or under. That's what I usually aim for. This one's 10, fiber five, protein six, and it's all natural. Pumpkin flax granola. This is a Kashi one. It's gluten free. I'm not really a gluten maniac, but it tastes delicious. Oh my gosh, sugar six, protein only two, fiber two, at least there's some, some of that stuff in there. And then this is Kashi, I love it, another Kashi. And we got sugar 11, oh boy, I'm living on the edge. Protein five, fiber three, ooh, sounds good to me. So I like to take a half a cup because I'm getting older now and I can't eat as much bread. Um, so I take a little of each thing and I'm gonna make one for my husband too. So a little bit of the granola, la 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 la. And then a little bit of the flakes. Yeah, I like to mix it up with the granola flakes and then something else. And then it's like a little surprise. There we go, half a cup. But if you're a uh, child or you know a growing person you want to do the full cup or three-fourths cup you look here and say serving size three-fourths cup and a lot of people actually put so much in their bowl they don't realize that they're pouring in like a million cups of cereal okay so you really gotta watch that i know my sisters think i'm crazy with this measuring cup and my husband but love this measuring cup. You are my life. I'm just kidding. Okay, so that's that. Now I'm going to do Steve's. He's going to get a little more because he's a much larger person and he's a man. So uh, usually a bigger man. I'm making a mess here. I always make a mess. It's nothing new. Don't pick. Oh, oh boy. Don't panic. Um, Okay, we'll just brush that to the side. Okay, next, blueberries. Blueberries, more fiber. Oh my gosh, I love my blueberries. The fresh ones are best, but then when they're not in season, I just get a bag of frozen ones. It's fine. La 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 la. The more, the merrier. Okay, just like that. Alrighty, sometimes I'm so crazy I'll actually count the blueberries to make sure we both have an equal amount, but that's good. Kind of, you don't have to do that, that's crazy. Okay, then I add flax seeds. Okay, Trader Joe's roasted ones are the best tasting. Um, but these are gonna do for now. Okay, so I just kind of sprinkle some in like that. Not too many, but just enough, kind of like do 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 do. Okay. Then I add cinnamon. I love cinnamon. Oh, and these flaxes, by the way, are supposed to be good for your hair and your skin and your nails and your heart. They got all those omegas. Omega, omega. Let me be good to my heart. Okay, so cinnamon. Just a few tap tap -a -roos. I heard cinnamon's good for headaches if you got a headache. And yeah, anything, spices, any kind of spices, they're always good. Okay, next comes the strawberries. This is the last day for you, strawberry, because they're starting to eh, get a little mushy, but this is definitely usable. So I just kind of break them up into pieces. Do, 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 do. Like that. And this is the best way I like to cut. So I don't um, chop my fingers off. Okay. How many is that? That's one, two, three, four, five strawberries. I actually wrote a book, a children's book, about a girl that has crazy 
crazy adventure trying to save her strawberry fields. I hope you get to read it one day. Okay, next comes the banana. I love bananas. They're so good for you and I just found out when they have more spots, they're even better. I just read a whole article, oh my gosh. I used to hate the spots. Okay, banana, it's time for you to get in my bowl. So I just split it up, just half, because eating half a banana at a time is better, because then you won't get all that too much sugar, because they do have a lot of sugar in them, even though they're so wonderful for you. Oh. And sometimes I'll count these two, one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that right now. That's another crazy part of me, to make sure we both get the same situation. Doo -doo -doo. So this is a great way to get your whole grains and just be healthy. I'm trying to get my family to eat it like this, but eh, they're not really, you know, there yet, but it'll happen, it'll happen. Okay, now we add some milk and then 1% organic. This is what I like. And do do do. Oh, and I'm forgetting to tell you, I also add walnuts and um, uh, raisins, because they're so good for you too, but we don't have any. I keep forgetting it at the store. You know when you go to the store and you're like, I know I need something. I know I need it. But then you walk out and then you go home and you're like, ah, the whole reason you went to the store is for that, and then you forget it. It's ridiculous. All right, and then I like to mix it up nice and good. Do, do, do. Tastes better when you kind of mix it up there. And I have other breakfasts. I know that's not a word. I got a waffle surprise. I got my oatmeal surprise. So maybe I'll do some more of these. And if you want to learn gymnastics, I have so many videos on YouTube. Here's my um, gymnastics tutorial list. You can check it out. Hey, let's cartwheel, everyone. And I have lots of workouts too. Oh my gosh, I have so many. Because you have to, you know, keep up that strength, eat healthy, flip around, and then, oh my gosh, you're gonna have a wonderful you. So here are some workouts for you. And if anyone wants to buy one of these Gymnastics Rocks t-shirts with my little logo, or I have the little wrist, ugh, I have the little wristbands, fit and fun with Coach Megan with the little cat. Here's a little link for you if you wanna do that. Thanks to my husband for drawing my logo. He's very talented with that. And as always, here is your end of the video trick. This is gonna be delicious. I don't think I've ever done this before. Alrighty. Remember to always pull that stomach in when you push up. Oh boy. Oh boy, let's see. <laughs> okay, this is. Mm. Mm. That was delicious. I'll give you one more trick for you. And here's a handstand for you. Remember, don't do handstands in the kitchen, it's not the safest place. To do it but remember I have a handstand video and you can learn with me alrighty everyone thanks so much for watching I really appreciate it and enjoy your healthy cereal and have a wonderful strong healthy day bye <laughs>